Hi guys, welcome back to my channel today. I am doing a first impressions of the Bourjois Happy Light Foundation. It's supposed to be a luminous and flawless complexion in any light. This is with translucent pigments. It corrects without masking and it's a light enhancing foundation. First off, I've cleansed my skin, I've applied my SPF, and I'm going to apply my primer that I'm currently using, which is the Body Shop Wonder Blur Primer. So now that my skin's prepped and ready, I'm going to try this foundation for the very first time and then I'll do a close-up, I'll let you know my first impressions, I'll wear it throughout the day, do some check-ins and all that good stuff. What's great about this foundation is it does come with a pump. You can see it's kind of a traditional liquid foundation. There's definitely some consistency to it. It's not serum-y, it's not super liquidy. I'm using my Sigma F80 brush and applying it, focusing on the center. It smells good. It doesn't smell like paint, which is nice, and it doesn't have a weird fragrance, or a floral fragrance, which is also really nice. So buffing that in. First impression, it is really easy to blend. I barely had to buff it in or do a lot of bouncing and blending. It really, really blends flawlessly into my skin. It looks like skin still right now, and it's very nice. It color corrected, it evened out my skin tone, which you guys can definitely see, and I just really am impressed at how quickly it blended into my skin and really has just set rather nicely. It looks really, really good. I'm really impressed right now. Now it'll just be how it wears with my other makeup and how it lasts throughout the day. I'm going to put the rest of my face on and I'll do another check-in and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back with the rest of my face makeup and I have to say this foundation is very very good so far so good it is now 9 20 in the morning I will be having a pretty long day so I'll do some check-ins to see how the foundation has been wearing so far I really like how it is very natural finish it's very lightweight it doesn't feel like I'm wearing any foundation on my face it has a really good wash of color correcting properties it's reflecting the light very well I'm using natural light currently very natural very flawless very light coverage, but in a really good way, if that makes sense. I do love the packaging. It's a nice, solid glass packaging with a pump. Hey guys, it is now currently 3 p.m. and I'm out. I've been trying to edit all morning and all afternoon, but you can see in kind of afternoon light, I'm in the shade right now, the foundation is looking really good. It's still holding up. I haven't retouched or even I haven't touched my face whatsoever. I'm not shiny. I'm not overly oily. It's not doing anything crazy on my like on my typical dry patch areas. Let me try and get you closer. Focus. So I typically would get a little patchy around here, but it's looking okay. So from 9.20 this morning till 3 p.m. on the dot today. I'm a little oily right here, but it's not bad. Um, yeah, it's looking good. It looks like skin. Hi guys, I am now back. It is 9.39 in the evening. I've had the foundation on for just over 12 hours. I'm looking really, really shiny in the viewfinder. In person, I'm not quite as shiny as it looks like I am on camera, but I am getting a little oilier. I do have to say this foundation is doing a really good job in terms of light reflecting, color correcting, and staying lightweight. It is breaking up slightly now, but it has been 12 hours and I've had a rather long day without any touch up. If you're looking for something that's going to be super long lasting, this isn't going to be it, but I didn't expect it to be either because products that are made to be color correcting and lightweight and radiant don't always last 
super, super long. However, this did last me a good six, seven hours without any retouching. If you want it to last longer, you can always bring a powder with you, bring a blotting sheet, absorb any oils, and just dust a little bit of like translucent powder or even a slightly pigmented powder, you would be fine. I think it does its job, it color corrects, it does a luminous finish without being overly luminous or shiny or glittery or anything like that. It looks like a healthy, natural skin. It feels amazing on the skin. I don't feel like I need to wipe this off right now. The color did not oxidize on me. I definitely recommend this product for everyday use. I recommend it for teenagers and people who are getting into makeup or want something very lightweight, something very natural, something very simple. This is not gonna be your Kim K kind of look. This is not going to be that full face, fully covered makeup look. Definitely check this out. I'm quite impressed. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope you enjoyed seeing me try some of the products I purchased from my recent UK hauls. I say hauls because there are five hauls for my vacation. So if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, you can click this button and make sure to subscribe so you see all those videos that pop up in your feed and you can get all my new videos. I upload every Tuesday, Friday, and Sunday and if you subscribe, it'll show up in your feed. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. It really, really helps me out. If you didn't check out my last video, I will have it pop up right over here for you and you can click on over and watch that. If you're watching on an iPad or an iPhone, just click the description box below and click on those links because they'll take you to the next thing. And if you want to know about what I did in London and Paris, you can always check out my vlog channel as well, which is linked in the description box below. I'll also have it pop up right around here. Also, if you want to follow me on Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest, all those things, always linked in the description box below. But basically, you can find me at Serene Wu everywhere. I really appreciate you guys watching. Please don't forget to leave me a comment and let me know what you would like to see next on my channel. Or if you just want to say hi. I love hearing from you guys. It literally makes my day when I get to answer comments throughout my day. Whenever I get a free moment, I like to check my comments and talk back with you guys. So I will see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching and have a wonderful rest of your day. Bye. This is supposed to be a tint. What is this? <clears throat> it's not super oily or anything weird like that. There's a really loud helicopter. Excuse me.